Hi everyone, I am Dr. Hilal. Today I am going to discuss HIV transmission, ways to be transmitted and ways not to be transmitted. Ways not to be transmitted are plenty, so I am going to mention some examples of ways cannot be transmitted. Just you need to avoid the ways that HIV is confirmed to be transmitted. Now let us go and see the video and explanation. First of all, let us see what fluids that can contain HIV, what body fluids. Blood, including menstrual blood, semen and also pre-seminal fluid, vaginal secretions, breast milk. These are the fluids in the body that certainly contain HIV virus. There are some conditions or requirements for HIV virus to be transmitted. Of course, HIV virus must be present. Second, HIV must get inside the body of the one exposed to infection. Third, HIV must be able to reach the blood of this person. Now let us see how HIV virus can be transmitted. First, sex. How? Vaginal sex, anal sex, oral sex, all can transmit HIV infection. Vaginal sex means penis inside the vagina. Anal sex, penis inside the the anus, whether it's man to man or man to woman. Oral sex means mouse to the penis or mouse to vagina. We must know that condoms can reduce significantly the risk of transmitting HIV. Aside from sex, what else can transmit HIV virus? Sharing needles, like addicts when they receive medicine or drugs, in group with one syringe. Tattoo also can transmit the virus. Needle breaks like nurse, doctor, when they break themselves accidentally with a needle contaminated with the virus. Blood transfusion, which is rarely, can transmit the virus because of the comprehensive investigations and laboratory tests done to any blood donation. Also, a sick mother can transfer it to her baby during pregnancy or during lactation. Very rarely during organ transplantation also. It's rare because of the comprehensive investigations and the tests carried out before transplantation. Now let us see ways that cannot transmit HIV virus. Contact with the following body fluids, saliva, tears, sweat, feces or urine. As they don't contain the virus or they contain the virus in a very little amount that cannot lead to infection. Hugging, kissing, massage, shaking hands, insect bites. Also living in the same house with infected person will not lead to transfer of the virus or using his own personal items like towels, blankets, bed sheets, toilets, and etc. Only not to use personal items that are in contact with his blood, like shaving machines, toothbrush, etc. 